Jeffrey Epstein delivered a shredder from the U.S. Virgin Islands to his Palm Beach home in July 2008, not long after coming to a non-indictment concurrence with the government, as per Oceanic Records. At that point, in March of this current year, after a Florida government judge nullified that understanding, Epstein dispatched a Thailand floor covering extractor from the Virgin Islands to his Manhattan townhouse, as indicated by Oceanic Delivery Records incorporated by Import Genius and gave to the intercept. The disclosure has brought up issues about the degree of Epstein's potential violations. For what reason would the very rich person lender and indicted sex guilty party transport a 53 pound shredder and a Thailand rug extractor from the Caribbean to his Miami home? soon after his brush with the law? Blood contains DNA. Blood gets in the ground and under tile. Blood additionally gets under floor covering. Was Jeffrey Epstein something other than a pedophile who gone after underage young ladies? Block reports, Epstein, an extremely rich person agent, was captured in New Jersey Keep Going Saturday on charges of running a sex dealing ring that included tricking underage young ladies to his New York and Florida homes and taking them on worldwide flights on his plane, named the Lolita Express. Epstein was first blamed for manhandling underage young ladies, some of them as youthful as 14, over 10 years prior, and he dodged indictment possibly because of his prominent associations. A key test agents confronted when initially focusing on Epstein in the mid-2000s was a powerlessness to get proof through subpoena. A 2005 hunt of Epstein's Palm Beach home came up void as it continued looking for PCs that examiners presumed contained basic proof associated with his supposed sexual maltreatment of young ladies. In 2007, a government great jury subpoenaed the PCs. That August, Acosta, who is presently Donald Trump's work secretary, went into supplication understanding discourses with Epstein. Due to those discussions, a movement to urge creation of Epstein's PCs was postponed, as indicated by the Miami Herald. Epstein waited, notwithstanding, opposing the arrangement since it would expect him to enroll as a sex wrongdoer. The FBI kept researching and in March 2008, as indicated by the Miami Herald, arrangements were being made to take the case to another government fantastic jury. That would demonstrate pointless as Epstein consented to an arrangement with Acosta. Without informing the 32 distinguished unfortunate casualties, the national government came to a non-indictment concurrence with Epstein in return for his blameworthy supplication in state court to a minor offense. He confessed on June 30. On July 7, 2008, government examiners told Epstein's lawyers by means of email that they proposed to advise the 32 unfortunate casualties about the understanding. Epstein's legal advisors and the investigators discussed the amount of the consent to uncover, choosing a not exactly full bookkeeping. After seven days, on July 15, Epstein got a shipment at his Palm Beach home from the port in the U.S. Virgin Islands nearest to his home there, as indicated by sea transportation records arranged by Import Genius and gave to the Intercept. The shipment was a 53-pound shredder. For the following decade, Epstein's legitimate inconveniences gave off an impression of being behind him. At that point, in November 2018, the Miami Herald distributed another examination concerning Epstein's supposed youngster sex dealing ring, which provoked government agents to investigate the case. Be that as it may, the deal to avoid indicting first must be nullified. That went ahead February 21 when the Florida government judge decided that Acosta's offers had disregarded the Crime Victims' Rights Act by keeping the ladies in obscurity. On March 11, 2019, Epstein got another shipment from the port in the U.S. Virgin Islands. This time, it was sent to his New York townhouse, and it's recorded in sea records as a Thailand floor covering extractor that gauged 191 pounds. William George an expert with Import Genius who found the subtleties of the shipments in the organization's database, noticed that the two shipments could, obviously, be altogether random to the supposed violations and the indictments. For sure, numerous individuals claim shredders or Thailand drug extractors don't run tyke sex dealing rings to support the worldwide first class. In any case, the planning could require a clarification from Epstein. 
he is as of now in prison anticipating preliminary and inaccessible for input. His legitimate delegates did not react to a solicitation for input.